Hope you guys are doing well. Welcome back to the MS PowerPoint video series. So last class in the last class we have discussed about the basics of the MS PowerPoint. So now we are going to move to the option. So as you can see, here is the option for the new slide. Before using this option, we are going to the design tab. After going to the design tab, so as you can see, here are a lot of designs here. For example, if you want to apply this one, you can also do that. If you want to apply this one, you can also do that. There are a lot of designs are here. You can apply. It's up to your choice. For example, I'm going to click on this and I'm going to choose any other design. For example, we are going to use this one. So I'm going to click on this. So as you can see, the design is applied. If you want to change the color, you can change the color from here. Don't worry, we will discuss about this tab. Let's go to the back. So go to the home tab. And as you can see, here the new slide option. So these are the basically slide layouts. It's up to you that which slide layout you are selecting. And you will also see some layouts here as well. These are the same. As you can see, two content, section, header, and all the details are provided here. You can choose according to your need. For example, I'm going on the first slide and after coming to the first slide, we have to write. The, so now we have to write the topic here. So I'm going to write that uh, computer. So here's the computer and then select this. And if you want to make it bold, you have to click on the bold option. And I'm going to make correct the spelling of the computer. Right click on it and make it correct. And after that, I'm going, if you want to make it italic, you can click on this. If you want to underline, you have to click on this. And if you want to, and if you want to give it a shadow, you can also give it a shadow to it. And after that, I'm going to increase some font size. And we have the reset option. If you will click on the reset option, the all formatting will be erased and it will be back to normal. So I'm going to click on this. As you can see, the all formatting is removed. So this is the function of reset. And after that, if you want to, so these are the basic font properties. So I hope all are the aware from this. So I hope you guys understand this video for today's class. It's enough. So about the next option, we will discuss in the next class. So see you guys in the next video.